rồi tao ơi đổi rồi đổi rồi Yes, so guys, welcome back again to our channel. In case you're new here, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Yes, I just got reports from some of my clients in Vex now that there is a typhoon that happened in Vex now recently. A typhoon disaster that happened in Vex now. This typically we all know that earthquake happens frequently in Syria and Turkey. There was a time earthquake killed over 6 million people in Turkey and Syria. But typhoon is similar to hurricane. I'm sure some of us have been hearing it. That happens in US and all of that. In China especially, yes. This is another country that experiences this type of thing. It happened in Vietnam. And you can see the pictures. You can see the video. Let me play one particular video for you to watch so that you can see this video of how this typhoon destroyed parts of Vietnam. Yes. and I'm sure some of us have seen many of these things happening on television. Yes. If we are from a country that this type of thing doesn't happen, like Nigeria, we don't experience earthquake, hurricanes, or typhoons. We don't experience all of these things. Yes, what we just uh, have is uh, this uh, Boko Haram bad deeds and a lot of kidnappings in Nigeria. That is what uh, a man-made disaster, that is what we have. But uh, natural disasters, we don't have any of it. So if you are from a country that doesn't experience any of these things, you need to thank God. Yes, because all these things can, all these things destroy lives and property. Imagine buying a television like this for over five hundred thousand naira. Yes, for over for for for, for almost three hundred dollars or three fifty dollars. Then a typhoon happens. Television is gone, your properties is gone, your car is destroyed. A lot of things are destroyed. You lose a lot of money. And especially if you don't insure any of these your properties. Yes, there's a, the, 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 these are the things that many of these European countries are facing. Many of these Asian countries are facing. And these are the things you need to be expecting, especially if you intend traveling to these countries. It happens once in a while. Yes, it can happen once in a year or twice in a year. Yes. So please, can you take note of that? So, we have come to the end of this video. By the way, I also process Mauritius visa on arrival package. I also process Malaysia 3 month studies visa. I also possess Vietnam, which we just talked about, the country of the typhoon. Three months storage visa. Vietnam three months storage visa is just 220,000 Naira. Yes. I also possess Tunisia three months storage visa. I also possess Morocco three months storage visa. I also possess Qatar two years freelance visa. I also possess Kuwait two years direct employment. There's a difference between direct employment and freelance visa. Yes. Direct employment is when you are obligated to work for the company for the period of two years. While freelance visa is when you get a job with the company, you can leave the company even after two weeks, even after one week of working with the company, even after one month because you are with your freelance visa. That is the difference between freelance visa and direct employment. Yes. 
I also process Oman two years freelance visa, which comes out within eight hours. That is for Oman. Oman visa comes out within eight hours. And the price for Oman is 850,000 Naira. Yes. So, if you find this informative, if you find this educative, don't forget to click the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Please don't forget to click the like button. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Yes. Thank you and God bless you. I'll see you guys in the next one.